And the Biden administration has made a big show of going after those domestic extremists that Molly was talking about. They're lurking in the shadows. So imagine our surprise when he seeks to elevate one into his own administration. Fox's own Trace Gallagher has the story from our West Coast newsroom. Trace, what is this about? Well, Laura, Tracy Stone Manning is President Biden's pick to head the Bureau of Land Management. When she was a graduate student back in 1989, Stone Manning was a member of the environmental group Earth First and was linked to an eco-terrorism case of tree spiking in Idaho's Clearwater Forest. Now, tree spiking is where you hammer a metal rod into a tree to protect it from being cut down. Tree spikes can also break or shatter saw blades, putting loggers in grave danger. Stone Manning was investigated in the case but struck an immunity deal with the government Government and testified against two men who were later convicted. Stone Manning now tells the Senate Energy Committee that she had no prior knowledge of the tree spiking plot and several media outlets bought it. In fact, because so many stories represented Stone Manning as a bystander or a victim, retired Forest Service investigator Michael Merkley, who led the case, wrote a letter to the Senate Committee calling Stone Manning the, quote, nastiest of suspects, saying she wasn't just a member of Earth First, she was part of the hierarchy, adding, quoting here, she was vulgar, antagonistic, and extremely anti-government. She was very uncooperative and refused to provide the hair, handwriting exemplars, and fingerprints as ordered by the federal grand jury. Former investigator Merkley ended by saying he eventually learned that Stone Manning knew all along who committed the tree spiking crime. Now, GOP Senator John Barrasso, the ranking member on the Energy Committee, says he believes Stone Manning lied to the committee and that President Biden should withdraw her nomination, which apparently is not going to happen because despite the former investigator's letter, the White House is sticking by Stone Manning, saying she is, quote, exceptionally qualified. We should note that Democratic Senator Joe Manchin, who could be the deciding vote, has not yet revealed which way he's leaning, but he calls Stone Manning a good person. Laura. The ultimate Washington power broker, Trace. Thank you. Yep. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.